The cable news giant claimed that Fox News host Sean Hannity pointed a handgun at colleague Juan Williams on October of last year and implied it was done in a fit of anger. The sensational headline read, Sources, Sean Hannity once pulled a gun on Juan Williams. The story, written by Dylan Byers, claimed that Hannity has a quick temper and the gun-pointing incident was merely a logical progression of that. As proof, Byers claimed that the Fox News host called those he disagreed with a jackass at least 21 times on Twitter, often in his defense of President Donald Trump. A jackass? That's um temper, all right. I do not start fights, but I finish them. This is pure entertainment for me. If people take cheap shots I hit back, Hannity was quoted as saying. In an incident where Hannity's version of entertainment can go too far, CNN reported that, after he and Williams had an on-air argument, the host pulled out a firearm, flicked on the laser sight, and pointed it directly at his colleague, causing the laser's red dot to bob around on Williams' body. For the record, Hannity's colleagues brought the Williams incident to the attention of Fox News executives, though it's not clear whether anything came of it. The sources said it went to Bill Shine, the network's co-president and longtime Fox News executive, who is Hannity's longtime friend and a former producer. A Fox News spokesperson said the incident was referred to the legal and human resources departments. Sean Hannity has been trained in firearm safety since he was 11 years old and has a license to carry a gun in five states, including New York, Fox News said in a statement to Kmoney. The situation was thoroughly investigated, and it was found that no one was put in any danger. While discussing the issue of firearms, I showed my good friend Juan Williams my unloaded firearm in a professional and safe manner for educational purposes only, Hannity's statement read. Every precautionary procedure that I have been trained in since the age of 11 was followed. I've had a concealed carry permit in five states for all of my adult life. Any other interpretation of this is outright false reporting. The whole thing was best summed up by Twitter user GoGrama, with a correction. But Hannity wasn't done and took to Twitter to let buyers have it, calling him a fake news hack. He also denies pointing the gun at Williams. Finally, responding to New York Post editor John Podhetz's assessment that Hannity should have gone to jail for the incident, the Fox News host said, Go Grandma was right, it's a big fat nothing burger.